What's up guys, it's your boy Damone, aka The Motivational, and today we are going to do a Lapis Challenge update video. Um, you know, I've been trying to post the, the, the videos here periodically on Twitch on what I thought was important. A lot of the videos just been me non-stop farming, um, so I didn't upload those. Um, as you guys can see, I'm almost level 50, halfway there. Um, so there's a couple of things that I wanted to touch on, you know, touch base with you guys with to let you guys know what's going on. Uh, first and foremost, we want to talk about rune updates. Uh, Lapis is still exactly the same. <laughs> Except we got a crit damage rune now in slot 4, which is nice. It's pretty bad, but, you know, it'll do. Okay? So these are the stats here. If you guys are wondering about the fight runes, it was from an event. Um, I got lucky and got some average ones, so I've just been rolling with these because they gave me some accuracy. It makes it Lapis a little bit more effective. I'm still, still trying to find a despair set that I can throw on her. I'm just waiting for a slot 6 attack percent rune, and then I can make that happen. But, hey, you know, I'm just kind of waiting. So, so then, um, see what else here. So, on my Charlotte, uh, chain search she's at 80%, 121. Crit damage is still really low. Accuracy, you know, decent. is high. Kind of on the high end. But, um, I'd like to get, like, another 40 to 60% here. Um, or 80% if I'm really optimistic. <laughs> or maybe 100% if it's really crazy. But that's what I'm looking forward to get on, on Charlotte. Um, we're going to start building my Samath here pretty soon, specifically for TOA, because I want his skill reset um, here, just because it's just amazing. So we're slowly starting to work on his set here. He's way too slow. My goal here for him is over 200 speed, um, as close to 100% crit rate as possible, 200% crit damage, um, and 30 to 50% accuracy would be nice. Uh, if I can get him to 20k HP, it'll be cool. But again, this, these are long-term goals. This is what I'm working towards getting pretty much on all of my attackers, okay? Um, Shannon, I still, still, still have not pulled a Megan. So, you know, Shannon's still here. She's chilling. Still on this five despair set. <laughs> just, just chilling. Just chilling. Uh, my Bernie's coming along. He's at 225 speed. Um, I haven't maxed his slot 2 yet, so we still got another 10 speed floating around over there. Um, as I continue to get better runes, my goal is... Um, I don't plan on leaving Giants until I get Bernie to 300 speed without without grinds, okay? So 300 speed is the goal um, without grinds, okay? So that's, that's what we're working on here. That'll be my indicator that I'm going to go ahead and leave Giants. Um, Bella, I six starred, so she's almost at 20k HP now. Chilling, thousand defense. She's living the dream. 51, she's good all the way. I, I maybe want to get some more speed on her. I don't know. Maybe I'll leave her slow like this uh, for Necro later, but I haven't decided yet. Um, but that's what's going on with this. I was thinking about building Argon. Um, he's at 73, 124. I haven't plused any of his runes yet. Uh, I got him on like on a weird set right now. I've been trying to get Swift runes so I can replace these two Fatals. Um, well, actually, no. I've been trying to get Fatal Rune so I can replace these two Swifts. Uh, <laughs> yeah, the other way. Uh, but I haven't decided if I'm going to plug Argon in and place a Bernard yet, or maybe just level him to 35 and save him for Vero. I haven't decided. Vero's not going to happen until Dragons, for those of you guys who are wondering. Um, I got Darien here. He's just kind of chilling on the Despair set that I just threw on him. Same thing with Molly. They're just kind of chilling with leftover runes. I had all these Despair support runes that are just hanging out, because I've been pulling a ton of them. Um, so they're just kind of, like, just chilling right now <laughs> they're just kind of chilling um and that's what's going on with that um in terms of pools um pools we i got Hua verde uh i pulled emma yesterday i got lisa last night uh i pulled a couple of these and i have a tyron um and then i just been saving my three star max rainbow mine at the beginning i've been getting tons of wind mystic witches so whenever megan if megan ever does decide to come we got fodder for her so so that's that's what's going on there um, as you guys can see, I'm still consistently focusing on the same core units. I'm not really stretching out to build anything else, really. Uh, I just want to, you know, keep that laser-like focus on the units that I'm building. Um, in terms of towers, if you guys are wondering how I've been progressing on towers, um, this is where we are at. Okay, so my Sanctum of Energy is level 3. I haven't bought any of these other issues. Um, my crit damage tower is level 5. So I'm working on getting the 720 so I can get to level 6. Um, then from there, I'll be building my Ancient Sword. Then I'll build all of the element attack. Um, and then I'll roll into everything else after that. I know most people build the Speed Tower first, but I'm doing it different this time around. Mainly going damage and stuff for PvE, since I'll be in PvE for a while. And then from there, you know, 
equal role. So my damage towers, the two elemental damage towers that I'll be doing first are my wind tower and my water tower. I'll be doing those first after I do attack. Okay, so that's what's going to happen there. Uh, so I can maximize my giants and maximize my dragons whenever I get to dragons. Okay, so that's what's going on there. In terms of TOA, oh, we are currently at floor 83. I'm having a lot of trouble. Um, because currently with this floor, like, these dudes can't get a turn. My damage output isn't high enough with Lapis and uh, Charlotte yet because the crit damage is so low. Um, otherwise, I would just nuke the hell out of this floor. But I'm not able to do that just yet. Hence why I was thinking about popping in some math so I can get the skill reset on two. And then they don't have any skills and then I just blast them to hell. But since I'm unable to do that right now, I'm back in Giants. I still got, I don't know, how, how many days? 20 days to reset, so I got plenty of time. But I'm steadily working my way through TOA. So if you guys are wondering, like I told you guys, I would use the same Giants team that I was using to do all of TOA, which is exactly what I am doing. Understand, guys, the key to TOA is Despair units. Lapis is OP. And if I had her on Despair, oh my god, dude, it would be crazy. I'm telling you, it would be crazy. It's going to be crazy. But, um... Right now, I'm just running uh, Shannon on Despair, and I'm running Charlotte on Despair, okay? So, so that's the big thing there, guys. TOA, yes. Get, get, get runes, focus on your team, clear TOA. It's not that difficult, uh, at, least, at least not normal anyway, and then it gets more into stats than TOA hard. So we're working on that, almost done with TOA. Only got 17 more flo floors to go, and we will clear. So, um, I mean, that's pretty much it. Um, I'll be farming back at Giants for those of you guys who haven't been following uh, the Lapis Challenge. Um, I'll be here consistently just kind of plugging away been saving my legendary runes uh, for appraisal and stuff because they haven't been rolling very well before but now they're gonna roll great they're rolling great now they're gonna roll great I'm gonna speak that into existence uh, but that's what's going on with the account so I uh, just wanted to pop in real quick give you guys a quick update as to what's going on with the Lapis account um, for those of you guys who are curious uh, who don't really have the time to watch the full stream but still want to know what's going on uh, that's where we're at in the short amount of time that we've been doing this so uh, working on going on three weeks now on this account, and it's going great. It's going great. Making a lot of progress, doing a lot of things. If you guys are wondering how I'm doing, I'm just farming giants literally all day, every day. If I'm awake, I'm farming giants. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's just what it is. So uh, with that being said, guys, thank you guys so much again for all of your continued support. Um, for those of you guys who want to watch this live, I pretty much stream this every day if I'm not doing account optimizations on Twitch or account reviews on Twitch. Uh, for those of you guys interested in getting account reviews or account optimizations, definitely check the information in the inform in the description. Uh, you guys can find out how you guys can get those. Uh, and then just tune in on Twitch. Let me know. We'll get you scheduled. And you guys can do what it is that you need to do and we'll help you get to the next level in your game. Love you guys so much. You guys have a wonderful day. And we'll see you guys in the next video.